Hello friends, so welcome again. Now I have fixed these uh, links here. So for that uh, I have created a new component which I name it admin links. Okay, and add the links is the same link we have with the nav link, just change the uh, classes. And now in the admin blade, I added the admin link here. Okay, and the shrev wrote admin roles and this active if this route is the request route is okay. And I'm going to add in the GitHub so you can find that. Now let's create the create page because if we go now, we don't have also the link in the index. Add the route and uh, roles create. Save the same thing here at the road permission create save okay now refresh and if I click here we don't have the create method in the road controller let's go and create that close this close this open the road controller and create the method here so function with name uh, create and return return a view admin roles create okay save go to the resources roles we have this index and save this as a create blade okay uh, in here now I'm going to remove everything and just say here we need the form save this come here and refresh and yeah now we have the form also this link is going to be right here and to go back to the roles so let's change this remove this justify end because by default it's going to go to the start and the route is admin roles index index also the name we need to change so i'm going to say role index page save and refresh and yeah here we are okay uh, and i don't like this um, i'm going to add the text to be slate 100 okay run the npm run watch okay and yeah we have now the white okay here we need the form and for that i have this form here so you can find in this uh plate elvincs.com CS, uh, website and this string so let's copy this and uh, paste it here so white what we need in the create form we need only the name Okay, let us paste that. It's save. We don't need the text area. So in the text area, inset here, I'm going to add the button. So let's say uh, button. This type is going to be submit. And add some classes. So px4 and py2. Is going to be bg green 500 on hover bg green 700 rounded md and that's it let's say 
create okay next one is the removal so this one image we don't need the image and input type text like this is going to be name so let's, let's say name no, we don't need the, this wire model lazy we, we are not working with uh, live wire also i'm going to remove uh, this one and i think we are okay save go to the browser and refresh and here it is now we need only the name add the name and go and create that Okay, in the form, also we don't need any type multipart form data. We are not uploading images. Just say method. This is going to be post. And the action is going to be with the road, which is uh, admin roles store. Okay, and also don't forget that the CSRF token. Save this, and if I refresh and type something here, click create. We don't have that method, so we need to go and create that. Let's uh, say here function store, we need the request here and dollar sign request and here i'm going to say dollar sign validate and request validate the name we have only the name here so and let's say Is going to be required and also minimum of uh, three characters okay and now role create dollar sign validated and return sorry return to the road admin roles index okay save this go back and refresh so let's say a new role for example super Click create, we go back and here we have the super row. Let's uh, do the same thing and also if I go and create and say create here, we redirect back so we need that also the if we have any error. So in here and the class is going to be uh, text red 400 and also text small I'm going to say and uh, let's save this so if we have an error for name come here and refresh create and yeah the name field is acquired so let's do the same thing for the uh, permissions I'm going to select all here copy and go and create new file create.blade.php in the permissions and paste that in we need to change some here is going to be also in the 
action is going to be permissions and that's it save go now to the permission controller and create the method so permission oh sorry a function for create and here we need to return the view admin permissions create and after that create a new one for storing the permission store we need the request dollar sign request and the same things so i'm going to say the validated is going to be with the request validate and we need to validate the name and just say required for now and now permission create and create the validated and return back so return to the road permission index admin permissions index save let's go to the permissions go and create permission so let's say edit and edit like this edit the post edit post go and create that and we have the edit post here okay friends uh, that's it for this video and hope you enjoy please like and subscribe to this channel and see you in the next video all the best friends